boom. P90 girl here in Rhode Island at the Extreme Airsoft six year strong birthday bash. Now, I gotta say, it's a wonderful thing to have you come up. Not only did she come up, she drove up with the family from Georgia and they're all here having a great time. Now, I gotta ask, how was the drive up? It was really long and rainy and there's so many tolls. So many tolls, I'm guessing like 90% of those happen through New York and Connecticut. Yep, definitely. Now, this is your first time up in New England? Yep. So, as a, as a player who's down, uh, down south, I know there's a, there's a very well-established, uh, there's a very well-established range of airsoft facilities down in Georgia, especially the Atlanta area. Now, what, what kind of expectations did you have coming up to the Northeast? I know there's not really a lot of, there's not really a lot of hype about New England, but uh, I mean, just be honest. What, what was your expectation? I'm, I'm being invited to go up to this place, Rhode Island. It's probably off the coast of New York. Where is Rhode Island? <laughs> Oh my God, if I close my eyes and take a nap, I'll go through the entire state not knowing it. But I mean, really, honest opinion. Well, what did you expect when you came up here? Um, I actually didn't have a lot of expectations. It was definitely pumped up. I thought it would kind of be like uh, just another really big event. And um, I thought it would be like, in, like, I thought it'd be really small and not a lot of major airsoft here. Because I haven't heard a lot about airsoft up here um, but it met, met my expectations it went above that it's a, there's a lot of people here it's really fun their field is super cool no oh, i mean it's good to come in with a blank uh blank expectation so i mean have, have you gotten it you got to get out in the field and game a little bit so i mean so what what do you think about this style of field the modular setup the buildings that rotate uh, and, and are moved pretty often the lighting and what, what's your experience been? I know you're P90 girl, your specialty's close quarters. So, I mean, give, give us a lay down. Well, I definitely think the modular field is really unique and really different, especially the themed, the themed bunkers and themed buildings and then the lighting. There's not a lot of dark lit fields where I come from. There's probably like one. And a lot of people um, don't really like that, but the way you guys have it with still like perfectly enough light to see and it lets people sneak around. It's perfect for its size. It, it pretty much is a really great field to play. And you did a lot with the space that you guys had. Now, it's, it's pretty cool that you're coming up, uh, you're flying the Valken banner. So, I mean, you gotta give your shout outs to Valken, I mean, you were Bobby, I mean, so what, as, as, a, as a representative from Valken, I mean, what, what are you excited to see that they're bringing up to the field? I know they got their booth set up with a few guns, they're actually, actually letting people test fire the guns on the turf right now. Uh, so, I mean, what, as a sponsored player, what products are you excited that, that you're getting to either run right now, or that you're seeing on the shelf that are getting ready to come out? Well, this today was actually my first time shooting the battle machines that just came out. Um, I like them; they shoot really straight. Um, I've heard bad things and good things about them, but after testing them out and actually running with them, um, I think they shoot really straight. I've never had any of them jam or misfeed, uh, so I like that. And then I shot the V12 before, um, but not the one they have out there, the brand new one. So that's pretty cool. V for Valken. She's got that Valken life going on. All right, now. Just Rhode Island in general. I gotta ask someone from down south. I gotta bring it up. I asked the guys from Arkansas, and uh, they seem to like it. So, I mean, you're up in New England. We're known for our wonderful blizzards and 10 feet of snow. So, and what do you, what do you think about the state? Um, I think it's cool. I like it. You guys don't have self-serve gas stations, or maybe that's just where I was at. Um, I like the weather. It's not as humid as Georgia is. There's a breeze. Yeah. Wonderful, wonderful breeze. <laughs> Happens to be fan powered. But um, <laughs> it's great having you up here. Now, I mean, you, you brought up that you didn't hear a lot of uh, things major about airsoft. I mean, are you, are you seeing, as, as an example, I mean, did you expect to see such a turnout of so many well organized groups of players? Well, actually, where I come from, there's not a lot of organized teams in here. Um, there's teams, but not as, I talk to a lot of people out there and a lot of them are on teams and you can tell they're on teams, they have patches and they're pretty way more organized than where I come from. And they're not like those, they don't look like those teams are just going to be around for the summer. They're going to be around for like a year or two. Um, so that was pretty cool seeing that and talking to a lot of people uh, about how Airsoft is here and the types of guns they like versus the players that I'm, that I'm normally talking to. Um, so it's pretty cool. Seeing all the different variety of guns, I normally just see like M4s and stuff, but there's like different stuff like the Honey Badger and like the Tar, and then I'm saw, seeing some pretty interesting stuff up here. Probably saw a couple P90s out there. I know I know, I saw a couple of them. 
Yeah, a lot of people, a lot of people were talking to me about P90s. We had a great conversation. Well, thank you very much for coming up, and uh, you guys can look forward. Hopefully, maybe next year. I mean, is this is this enough to draw you to come up to Rhode Island for a couple more events? Is this yeah, worth the drive? This is a lot of fun. I like it. All right, guys. Well, that's it for uh, for me and P90 Girl. We're gonna get back to it. Try and get this girl out in the field and sling some more plastic. Thank you very much for coming. It's been a pleasure having you. Fun. All right.